Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of Below Cat's Weapon Closet. First off, before I begin, I'd like to thank iCrazy for helping me, well, record uh, information about the bar. Thank you so very much. And he will be mentioned inside the video right now. I think I'm just gonna uh, put both the, um, the bar and the throwing knives both inside the same video. You know, I like to always do two videos, two guns per video, or at least two weapons. One other thing, um, I've noticed that I am running out of uh, weapons to present, and that is of course a bad thing. So, to help expand more of the Blue Cat Weapon Closet episodes, I'm deciding to do information about melee weapons now. Uh, this is just to make the episodes, you know, just get a little bit more episodes in. The, the problem is, is that I really don't have that many melee items, and I don't want to buy any melee items, it's because I really don't like to. Because I, I have a nice deck that deals 7 damage. I've been using that for, what, 2 years now? I'm still using it. Uh, I just recently got a Goku dagger, so I guess that's a good thing. Yeah, that can also be thrown into another episode. And, well, that's just about it. So, I guess now we can talk about the T-Knives. Which, I just abbreviate T-Knives, which otherwise means throwing knives. But, let us begin, shall we? So, normal damage is 8. Maximum damage is 9. And minimal damage is what? Six? Yes. Six. The fire type. It is a semi-automatic throw. Basically, you're just throwing the weapon. Alright, so clip size. I wouldn't say infinite. It will be based on how much... Well, you know what? Yeah, I guess you do have an infinite clip size. But... The gun basically result revolves based on how many you actually buy, but you never really have to reload or like have to stop for a couple of seconds to get more. Like, do you get what I'm talking about? So right now I think I have about like five thousand or something. Uh, T knives, T knives, T knives. Dying knives. Oh, I have four thousand. Okay. <laughs> oh, by the way, uh, I recently just got the Greylands bow. So that will also be added to another blue cat weapons closet another day. Right. So the clip side, I guess, is based on how many, how much you buy. Uh, knives per shot. That will just be one. The accuracy. It has well. It has good accuracy. Okay, you know what? Screw that. <laughs> it's actually pretty inaccurate. <laughs> After just seeing that. Uh, freeze rate. It's a low freeze rate. I wouldn't say it's very low. You do stop just for at least about half a second or so. Yeah, let's just let's say it has a low freeze rate. Um, fire rate. Meh, moderate. Reload speed. Uh, not available. Price. The price is one event coin. For one event coin, that gives you 1,000 knives. Uh, PK recommended. Uh, mm, no. Nah. There are plenty of other guns out there besides throwing knife that you can do a lot better with PK. But if you're a beginner, and you just recently got an event coin, and you're looking for a much better weapon, and you can't afford anything else, like the shotgun, or, um, or it's going to take you time to get the shotgun, or the AK-47, or at least any other gun, then don't hesitate to go with the throwing knives. I mean, it's not bad. Well, I mean, it's not really good, but it's not bad either. It's, it's, it's a good, it's decent, I would say. Probably just on a scale of 1 to 10, it'll probably be right smack on 5. So, spar recommended. 
no, once again, there are plenty of other guns out there that you can use for sparring. Base recommended. Actually, yes, I would recommend this for base. Pirate Zone especially, because there's a little, I wouldn't say a glitch, but there's like a little, uh, it's like, there's a wall you can throw the knife through. And it's such an effective point where it would be base recommended, at least for, um, Pirate Zone and one little portion inside Mafia. Uh, Streak recommended. No. So basically, it's just base recommended. Well, it seems, this episode seems short, but it's not really that short because I do have the other boss segment with I Crazy in it. So I'm going to combine the two together and make that all into one episode. I will be doing at least two other episodes being uploaded today. And that's going to be about the Grailian's bow and the Uzis. Well, guys, I guess we should finish this up right now, shall we not? Thank you. <coughs> I accidentally clicked on the stop button. <laughs> Finishing up. Thank you guys so very much for watching. <laughs> that's so embarrassing. Thank you guys so very much for watching. I'll see you guys another day.